A highly experienced U.S. Navy fighter pilot has described an unexplainable encounter with a wingless object not from this world performing high-speed aerobatics. The erratic and extraordinary flight patterns of the unidentified flying object 160 kilometers off the Californian coast in 2004 have continued to baffle retired Commander David Fravva. I can tell you, I think it was not from this world, Fravva told ABC News. I am not crazy, have it been drinking? It was, after 18 years of flying, I have seen pretty much about everything that I can see in that realm, and this was nothing close. Fravva's cockpit vision captured the logic-defying encounter, and has been broadcast just days after it was revealed the Pentagon spent $22 million a year on investigations into UFOs between 2007 and 2012. The existence of the Advanced Aerospace Threat Identification Program had never previously been acknowledged by the U.S. Department of Defense. Fravva had been flying his F-18 fighter on a training mission when a controller on a U.S. Navy ship alerted him to an object dropping 24,000 meters from the sky and rocketing straight back up. As Fravva and other jets began to sweep the area, one pilot noticed an unusual object, about 12 meters long, shaped like a tick TAC hovering above the ocean. The UFO then began to perform a variety of aerial maneuvers that stunned the pilots who were flying for the biggest and most sophisticated military machine on the planet. I have never seen anything in my life, in my history of flying that has the performance, the acceleration, keep in mind this thing had no wings, Fravor said. We look down, we see a white disturbance in the water, like something's under the surface, and the waves are breaking over, but we see next to it, and it's flying around, and it's this little white tick TAC, and it's moving around, left, right, forward, back, just random, he said. Fravor and the other pilots dropped altitude to investigate, and the wingless object began to mirror their movements. I don't know if it was alien life, but I will say that in an infinite universe, with multiple galaxies that we know of, that if we're the only planet with life, it's a pretty lonely universe, Fravva said. The former U.S. Navy pilot said, to his knowledge, the military had not investigated the strange occurrence any further. Although the Pentagon has insisted its advanced aerospace threat identification program has been shut down, others claim it is still in operation. Since 2012, program officials have reportedly continued to investigate episodes brought to them by service members whilst also carrying out their other defense duties. Officials with the program told the New York Times they studied videos of encounters between unknown objects and American military aircraft, including one released in August of an oval object, roughly the size of a commercial plane, which was chased by two fighter jets off the coast of San Diego in 2004. The U.S. has repeatedly investigated UFOs. In 1947, the Air Force investigated more than 12,000 claimed sightings. Copyright 9 Digital Proprietary Limited 2017